Hello, I'm Laura from Foxtech, and today I'm going to explain why iCloud might be grayed out in your iPhone settings and how you can fix it. This issue can be a bit frustrating, but I'll go over several common reasons for it and what you can do to get things working again. One of the most common reasons for iCloud being grayed out is restrictions or parental controls. If these controls are enabled, they can block access to iCloud. To fix this, open your settings, go to screen time, and then tap on content and privacy restrictions. Here you'll want to make sure iCloud isn't restricted. If you're not sure what's causing the issue, you could turn off all restrictions temporarily to see if that solves it. Another possibility is that your device is managed by a school or organization. Devices under management profiles often have certain features restricted, including iCloud. To check this, go to Settings, then General, and look for VPN and Device Management. If you see a management profile, you can remove it if it's your personal device. But if it's owned by an organization, you'll need to contact their IT department for help. Sometimes the issue is simply on Apple's end. If iCloud is experiencing downtime or server problems, it may be grayed out temporarily. In this case, check Apple's system status page online to see if iCloud services are down. If they are, there's not much you can do except wait until they're back online. Lastly, it could be as simple as not being connected to Wi-Fi. Some iCloud features require a Wi-Fi connection to function properly. So, go to Settings, tap Wi-Fi, and make sure you're connected to a network. This could easily fix the problem and allow you to access iCloud again. I hope one of these solutions helped you resolve the issue with iCloud. Thanks for watching. If you found this video helpful, be sure to like and subscribe for more useful tips. See you later.